Hi guys, this is days 91 to 101 of Andy Man St. Paolo's adventure. Wow, we are on the last 10 days. It's absolutely amazing. But before we get into it, we just hit four and a half thousand subscribers. So thank you all so, so much. Now my next goal is 5,000. If you want to help the channel out, go down and subscribe now. Now let's get on with the video. Okay, we are back. Day 91. Wow, the final 10 days. Our main mission for the next 10 days, we are getting up here. This is where we're going. I think we'll be able to do it in the first couple of days, to be honest. So we're going to push up, maybe have a look up here as well. But yeah, we're going to have a look. I don't think there's really anything of much value up there, but that is the goal. We got the front line here. We push down here and so on and so on. So we got we got stuff to keep ourselves busy, but we're nearly, well, we're coming to an end with old Andy Mann. I've come quite attached to him, to be honest, but it ain't over yet. We got all these guns as well. But I think we're gonna we're gonna grab some food and then head up to the front line. Get ourselves some lovely, lovely cabbage salad. Um, the house is looking very good with these bar uh, with these metal sheets on, which is really good. Our garden is becoming a bit bit unruly, a bit wild with all the trees, but I like it. I like it. I like the aesthetic. But uh, let, yeah, let's crack on. Let's crack on to the front line. Get up to them buildings. All right, so we're here. There's a few zombies down there. The corpses have started to despawn. We never actually got the metal sheets on, did we? Maybe we look at dismantling some more, getting our metal working skill up to get that metal sheet protection. We could actually dismantle some stuff in the house. I don't know. I think an oven gives you quite a bit of experience. Yeah, a little bit. And the fridges as well. Let's just do a couple, see if we can get close. I would like to get them bar, them sheets on there. I think we could do it, you know. A couple more houses. Oh, we got some zombies. Just got to be careful going in these houses, not rushing in. It could be a... Uh, could be quite dangerous you know after I'll, I'll scare the other day and i have noticed this dead policeman here with a vest on we'll take that thank you very much sir that did save our life didn't it <laughs> and it may save our life again who knows well it's definitely safer down here anyway to explore oh we found like a fishing store not that we're going to do a lot of fishing but we may be able to dismantle a load of this stuff Oh, and there we go. Look at this. We took them all apart except for one. But we got to level six, so that's good. So we can actually put them sheets on our uh, on our car. Um, we may take a couple of sheets back with us, actually, because I don't know how many we got at home. We did use about ten, didn't we, when uh, we poured at the windows. Oh, wow. Where the hell did all these come from? All right, let's uh, push down. It's a bit late in the day. Actually, let's look what other, other buildings, other uh, shops we've got here. Eh, yeah, restaurant, not interested in that. All right, let's get out of here. Yeah, let's start shooting. Whoa, 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 who the hell is this guy? Oh my God, he's got a car. Car 15 Delta, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, yes, oh my God. Oh, yes. Um, has he got a magazine? What, what does it even take? It doesn't have a magazine. <laughs> I don't know if this is a suppressed one. I think it might be. Let's try and get back up to his body. I don't know who that was. What kind of zombie that was. Yeah, the cookery mache is definitely slower than vanilla mache. Thing is, with the car 15 Delta, I feel it's going to take 556, five, which we don't have a lot of. Oh, my God. Look at all of these. Maybe he's got a magazine or some ammo on him. No, just a Louisville map. Okay. All right, it's, it's 20 past five. We've had a good day. We've got the metal working out. We've got a nice new gun. So we're going to probably go home, I think. Let's not risk it. The rifle has well and truly taken a beating. We may use the lube on it, possibly. Or maybe on the car. I don't think we're going to... I don't think we've got the ammo for it. It's an M16 magazine. Yes, that's 5.56, isn't it? So we're not actually going to have much ammo for it. Thing is, as well, I've been keeping my eye open for it at the, um, the factory. Because I know it's, you know pretty rare and i haven't been able to find any home sweet home let's see what we're looking like metal sheets so we got six in there we got five in there um one in there you know what we probably do have enough uh, we got three in there yeah we should have enough i think right let's go and look at our uh our nice new shiny gun oh yeah it is actually suppressed as well oh. So we did actually have three M16 magazines that all had ammo in but it gives us a total of 87 and there's a five in the box so it's not it's not really a lot, is it? I mean, oh, I'd love to use it. We just don't have the ammo. Oh, look at that. That sounds so good. But we can't, unfortunately. 
Right, let's um, have a look around the area. We look good for zombies. I mean, we've got so much. Oh, actually, we're getting low on 308. Bloody hell. Um, I mean, we've got 40-odd 9mm, though, so it's probably going to have to be the MP5 or something afterwards, but it is what it is. All right, it's uh, 10 to 1. We're actually quite late today. Um, yeah, 10 to 1, we're going to hit the hay, and we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 92. We are, we're getting through them. We're getting through them. A day closer to that lovely, lovely 100. And what better way to start your day than a cabbage salad at 10 past 9 in the morning? You gotta love it. But today, oh, oh, we got a zombie. You know what I'm actually gonna do? I'm gonna test out that rifle. It led you, son of a bitch. Oh, look at that. It sounds so good. We got loads of 7.62, which is really annoying. Well, what are you going to do about it, eh? But the goal for today, we're taking this off. Can we put metal sheets on? Let's have a look. Yes, we can. Okay, let's get some sheets. We need screws, sheets, and bars. All right, let's get to it. Got down to 93%, and we killed a few zombies with it. Oh, it actually breaks it when you take it off. Unusable metal, so I don't think you can repair it then. Okay, well, that's good to know. It's definitely going to be one of my... Um, mods i have on all the time oh yeah look at that look at that we have had to drop our uh, guns and stuff because we're just so overweight but that is cool oh yeah we got the trunk protection on that i think that'll probably ah do we get i mean we don't have a lot of metal sheets how many is it to put a driver's side window on let's have a look oh we do have enough okay let's do it oh yeah we are now the road warrior amazing think that'll probably do us let's get rid of all this all this junk now and we can get our gun back you know what i don't think we need the propane torch anymore yeah i think we're done with it and that also means we can take the bloody mask off let's get that stalker cloak nice 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 oh it's got a hole maybe not then <laughs> oh we can though where a mask yes Get the prepper mask on. Cool, we look like someone out of a horror film. My God. Oh, look at her. She's an absolute demon. She's in pretty good condition all around as well. I mean, we could repair the brakes and that, but I don't think we need to, to be honest. I keep thinking I can hear zombies, so I've got to be careful. Ah, I could hear them. You bastard. Oh, right, it's 20 past 12. We're going to uh, go to bed, and tomorrow we're going to push back down into the town there, push the front line forward. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 93, we're pushing back down into the high street there. We're going to get some uh, some lovely, lovely cabbage for breakfast and then, uh, yeah, crack on. Oh, just notice we're at 77 weight, so we could probably do with some high-calorie stuff. Let's have some mac and cheese and some lovely cereal. There we go, two Chevys. Let's take a bit of food with us. Where the hell do all these, these dance cards keep coming from? I don't keep picking them up. They're just appearing in my inventory. Is that a thing? I don't know. I've no I just do not know, to be honest. Oh my god, I just realised we slept with the door open. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's take this wagon out for a test drive, baby. Alright, we're at the crossroads. Let's push on down. We could drive a little bit further down, but I don't really want to, to be honest. Because if we get swarmed, we need to be able to retreat to our car. Alright, we're at the church. Let's push on down. Let's actually get the rifle out now, I think. Oh, there's a lot of them coming. Come on in, you bastards. Let's have ya. God damn it, this gun is just jamming all the time now. Alright, looks like we got a bit of respite. They've stopped coming, so that's that's nice. Are our kills on? They gotta be uh well, seven thousand two hundred, that's not bad. I mean it ain't gonna set no world records, but I'll take it. Do with um like a lighter or some matches or something. We can just fill our lighter up though, so it's not horrendous. What's this little building here? Let's have a look at that. Oh, uh, a dentist or a doctor's maybe? Nothing of any great use to us. All right, we've made it to the first blue building. What do we have here then? Some zombies. Oh, is this a church as well? Some kind of community center. Well, nothing really worth uh, getting in here. A lot of flasks. Uh, I think they were... Oh, maybe it's uh, Alcoholics Anonymous, possibly. Well, I suppose they just use a community centre one there. That's why there's all flasks there. That's quite good if that is the case, or if it's just random, I don't know. All right, what else have we got here, then? What's, what's this building here? Probably some kind of uh, school or something, probably. Another school. Let's go and have a look. It's a waiting room here. This looks like offices. Oh, Lord, okay. Let's get out of here. Oh, so we can wear a riding helmet with a gas mask. Oh, God. Where the hell did all of these come from? 
Oh, they're dead now. Yeah, I remember this is some kind of construction site. And there was a hell of a lot of zombies up here when we came, when we drove through. Oh, this, this looks like it's a driving theater actually, maybe. That's pretty cool. Is this a police station? Mm, don't think so, but we're gonna have a look anyway. Oh, we have got a little bit of exerted from that. This could be a pretty good base location, actually. There's a nice fence all the way around it. I just wonder if there's any more exit. This could be a very good location once it's all cleared out. Um, this does not look like a police station. <laughs> well, I mean, there's one very close anyway, so... Hmm. Looks like it's fairly secured all the way around. This would be a really good base location. All right, but it's four o'clock. We should probably head back. Do you reckon we can go over this fence here? Oh, we are, t oh no, there's zombies there and we are a bit tired. We did it anyway. All right, home sweet home, baby. I got another card on me. Where the hell did I keep coming from? What the hell? What, what even is it? The Northern Soul? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Andy man, you got this, you got this. There's no use a breakdancer as well as a uh, construction worker, but also an absolute zombie slayer. All right, it's half past 12. We're going to have this cigarette and then we're going to go to bed. We'll see you in the morning. All right, day 94. Wow. Wow. Okay. Well, what we're going to do today is going to be a base day. We can actually mark these suckers off, can't we? Because, well, we've done them. And there ain't really nothing there. Maybe this is something. Do we try that? Yeah, maybe we try that tomorrow. It could, could be a little police station. I don't think it's going to be. But we can go and have a look at this little outskirts area. But we definitely need to sort out our guns. I think we're actually probably going to use Zalube on uh, on this Mini 14. The other ones aren't in much. I mean, we got the carbine. Yeah, they're not in much better condition. And this one's already got our stuff on it. So let's just repair this with the lube. Fire clean gun loot. Oh, we got four of them. Oh, we don't have a lot of 308s, actually. We don't have any other 308s. We only got 127. You know what? Let's take the M let's take the MP5. We'll put this bad boy to rest somewhere. Let's put it there on our counter. Lovely stuff. Look at that. Do we have two mags for it? Well, three, because there's one in there. So that's not too bad. We got another bloody dance card in there. Where do they keep coming from? What is this one? The Samba? Where the hell do they keep coming from? It's got to be a glitch or something, hasn't it? All right, it's 10 to 1. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Oof, I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do. Maybe we push up to that other blue building. We'll see, but we'll, uh, we'll catch you in the morning. All right, day 95. We woke up quite early. We wasn't really tired. We didn't really do a lot yesterday, but we're going to... Uh, yeah, I think we're going to push up to that building. We're going to wait for it to get a little bit lighter because winter is winter's coming. So we're going to wait for it to get a little bit lighter and then we're going to push up. All right, 10 past 7. I think that's a reasonable time. The light is okay now. We've got good visibility. Eight, weight is going up. We haven't took any food with us, so we probably need to starve ourselves for a, a little bit for the day. Um, but yeah, let's, uh, let's crack on. The plan is actually to go straight up. Let's pause it. To just push straight up to here. Or down past the front line, all up to here. And go from there, really. It's good because we've probably cleared out a lot of the zombies around that area. All right, we have made it, but it looks like it is a bus stop. <laughs> Brilliant. Let's uh, let's not mess around there. Let's get the hell out of here. It looks a bit busy. Let's head home. We've scouted the area. There isn't really anything worth taking or looking in, I don't think, up there. All right, home sweet home once again. Not a very productive uh, excursion, but... Um, it is what it is. I think I may have a plan. Now, let's get inside so it's safe. I've left our bloody back door open. What the hell? What we'll do for the last few days is push up into here, explore it a little bit more. There may be 556 in there, but there could also be gun storage in one of these. We could be missing some really big loot. I know it's going to be busy up there, but I think, yeah, I think that's, that's the plan, I think. There is a zombie banging somewhere. Come on, you bastard. What are you doing? Get out of my garage. You know, it would have been cool to actually have this as a garage and we could have reversed in. Drive up here, park it in there. That would have been really cool, but, well, it's too late now. And it's a lot of work for only the last few days, so I don't think we're going to, but we should have done. Oh, my God, we got bloody zombies here. Where do they all keep coming from? We are tired, but this guy, he doesn't want to tangle. Look, he's going. He don't want it. Well, you got it. All right, yeah, but 20 past uh, 11. Weight is good, so we'll probably have some cabbage. Hopefully that doesn't give us the old Chevy. No, that's fine. Let's go to bed, and tomorrow we'll push back into that industrial area. All right, day 96. We are looking good. We are looking good. It's a little bit later in the day. Um, what I want to try is 
I know we can wear the riding helmet. I've taken that off. I want to see if we can wear the other, um, the military helmet. I think we probably can do. Let's put it on there. Yep. Yeah. Oh, look at that. We are looking, we are looking good. We are looking good now. Now, what I want to do over the next few days is push on down here. This, we may be able to find some guns in there. Also, we'll have a look for some 556 as well while we're down there. So, that's the play. That's the play. Let's, uh, let's crack straight on with it, I think. Oh, where the hell have these come from? Hey, you bastards. Get the hell out of my turf, you bastards. All right, we'll park the car here. I am a little bit hesitant to use the MP5, but I kind of want it at the same time. Probably should have moved up a little bit away from the car, to be honest. Let's move the car. Let's move it. Retreat! All right, let's push on up a little bit, I think. Now we can use the MP5. Oh, they're coming, they're coming. All right, so we're up at another building. Let's go and try and get in here. All right, we are in, we are in. There's a couple of zombos. Looks like these are uh, storage. Hmm, interesting. All right, this looks looks like this one's open. There's nothing in there. Oh, we got ammo. We got ammo. I also hear zombies banging around all over the place. All right, well that's them dealt with. Let's um, have a look in here. Maybe we find some guns. I don't think we're gonna though. <laughs> Oh, we got a load of um, 9mm and 7.62, but we just cannot get 5.56. Oh, we got some guns. We got some, Oh, my AK-47. Yeah, we'll take that. Just check out this building before we, uh, we move on. You know what we got to try? You know what we got to try, don't you? We got to try the AK. Full auto, and it's got a magazine in it as well. Come on, you bastards. Maybe we just go for Lord I. Well, full auto it is, baby. All right, let's pull back, I think. All right, we're back at the car. Let's head back. Oh, no, we got a, we got a crack on our windscreen. That's not good. I mean, a cracked windscreen, it's not the end of the world. Um, it'd be good if they actually um, restricted your visibility. With a cracked windscreen. That'd be quite cool, actually. They'll probably add it, to be fair. It seems like something they'd add. Right, let's put the AK stuff away. Um, I think the MP5 is going to be the saviour. We've got a backup rifle if we need it, so it's good. All right, it's 12 o'clock. We're going to get some food and then hit the hay, and we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 97. We're going to push back on up to the industrial area there, try and clear a few more out before we hit that 100 days. Hopefully we'll get them all done. I think we will, to be fair. Have a bit of the old cabbage. Oh, where the hell did all of these come from? Well, I'm actually going to drive up here a little bit more because it seems like we've cleared it out a fair bit because we was blasting up here and we was fine. Maybe one of these zombies in here has broke down the, uh, the doors as well. Nope, they have not. Oh, well. I want to check this building out just up here, up north here. We didn't actually get round to it yesterday, did we? You candidates for the MP5. Come on then, you bastards. Let's have ya. I've lost count of what number massacre this is. Guns have been uh, really good this play. Let's have a quick look at our kills, actually. Nearly 8,000. And firearms, 3,367. So, fair few. Well, it looks like this is a garage. Okay. You know, wouldn't it be funny if we found the last um, Mechanics VHS? I don't know if you can find Mechanics VHSs in garages, though. I know you can find the books, but... All right, let's get out of here. All right, let's go check out these buildings. No 556. Five, Got a lot of 762 and some more 9 mil, but my God, we cannot find 556 five, anywhere. All right, let's start marking some stuff off. So where is old Gunny? Yeah, that goes there. That goes there. But that is done, and that is done. So we're getting through it. All right, so we got more ammo in here. No 5.56, five, though. Ah, the MP5 is jamming a little bit. 
You know what? Let's let's ball and then go full auto on these bastards. We do have 599 millimeter rounds on us. <laughs> what is our aiming at? Um, yeah, so we're at five. It's going to take ages to get to six. I think the drop off is at level five, to be honest. Yeah, not having a suppressed weapon is uh, kind of nice because it's actually drawing them all to us. So we haven't got to, you know, round them all out. They're all coming to us, especially with that M14 with a range on that. That was really nice. Full auto is quite viable. I never normally use it because I think it's quite inefficient. But I suppose when you're as good a, when you got good aim and it's quite good. We got a few coming from down here. Let's have, let's be having you, you bastards. Come on. Absolutely shreds. <laughs> right, looks like we got another ammo dump here. Let's have a quick look. Oh, we know there's ammo in that one. Just realised as well, there's actually a different sound for shooting inside. How quiet that is. That's nice. There's like a little echo. They don't mess around now. We're in and out. Tactical, baby. Oh, that was risky. That could have been bad. Right, let's get marking these off on the map. So these are actually all full of different ammo. Okay, nice. Oh, 666 nine mil rounds. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know. Let's check out these residential houses. We may actually stay down here tonight. Something a bit different. They are single story. I don't mind a single story house, but in a hostile um, position like this, I don't know how I feel about it. All right, it's 20 to 12. We are in them houses, hostile territory. We are going to sleep here, you know. I'm going to risk it. Could be a bad idea, but... <laughs> oh, a nice M4, M14. Let's take it, let's take it. The only food we managed to find was maple syrup. I'm not complaining. Um, how are our calories? Um, eight in drop, so that's fine. Okay, so let's go to sleep, and hopefully we make it through the night. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Day 98. We... Uh, We've made it. We have made it through the night. We're going to eat this maple syrup as a little victory uh, victory celebration. Lovely stuff. And let's keep pushing on and clear clear this area. I want to get it done in the 100 days, so let's do it. Hopping over this fence could be a bad idea, but I think we're okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Got a lot of wrecks here, but we don't really need any more um, uh, metalworking skills, so we don't really care about them. MP5 time, baby. All right, let's go get our car and then we can drive down to the last few buildings. All right, let's go, let's go. Could be busy down here. We haven't been down here yet. I want to see what this, this building is. Okay, it's a garage. It's a garage. Yeah, we don't really want to need to stay here. Um, it's probably not worth the risk, to be honest. Not for a garage. At least we know what it is now. Got a construction site. Oh, God, there's a tree there. Oh, God, get out, get out, get out, get out. Is there a lot of them around? What is this building? I think it's just offices. Yeah, just offices. Okay, don't need to worry about that. <laughs> We've been in there. That's where it was gated off. Okay, looks like we got a fair few here as well. Oh, well, <gasps> there's one more building down there. Let's go, let's go, let's do it, let's do it. A little bit out the way, so it could have some nice secrets. Well, there's a lot of, a lot of zombies. Do we do it? Do we do it? One final push, one final hurrah. Let's go. Reload, reload. Okay, we're out of mags, which isn't ideal. Just gotta be careful here. Let's not do anything too stupid. Well, looks like we got the majority of them. I did see a zombie with another MP5 that I killed, but I cannot remember where he is in all this pile of corpses. Oh, they still coming. Oh, Lord. What do we have here? Oh, yes. We got a suppressed one. We got a suppressed one. Finally. Oh, it's in good condition as well. Let's have it. Let's have it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. There we go. We have a suppressed MP5. Only took us, what, well, God knows, nearly 100 days, but we got one. And it had a magazine in it, so we got an extra magazine, which is really nice. Let's test this bad boy out, shall we? Oh, I hear zombies. Where are you? Mm, I think they're upstairs, which isn't ideal. 
guess this is just like the office area. Give it a shout. Come on, you bastards. Let me try out my new gun on you. Oh, I don't want to go upstairs. Oh, here we go. We got a candidate right here. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Amazing. Can we go upstairs. Yeah, let's go upstairs. <sighs> oh, God, that scared me to death. I mean, this just looks like offices, so let's get the hell out of here. Hey, you want to try out my uh, suppressed uh, MP5, you bastards? Yeah, I have some of that. All right, let's mark it. Uh, let's mark it all off, shall we? Where is the X? Yeah, done, done, uh, done, done. That is guns and no, that's nothing in there. So we we've, we've done it. We've done it. Let's. Ah, uh, I think after all that, let's let's head home for the last few days. You know what a way to end it. What a way to last the hundred days. You know, come down here. Surely we was on about seven thousand, weren't we? Uh, so 8,000, so we killed around about 1,000 there, thereabouts, which is pretty good going, I'd say. But Andy Man, it's only time for you to retire, old boy, if we don't flip the car going over all these bodies. I mean, a suppressed a gun is, you know, it's, it's end game anyway, isn't it? Like, you got you got nothing to worry about that. Oh, you know what? Let's, let's deal with these. Oh, we definitely conquered this place. My God. All right, we are home after a very, very successful couple of days, a little excursion. But uh, we're just going to chill around for the, the rest of the day, at least. That's for sure. You bastards. Get the hell out of here. Stop. Leave my fence alone. All right, it's 10 to 11. We're going to, uh, we're going to have a smoke. We're going to have some food. And we're going to go to bed. And we'll see you tomorrow. All right. Day 99. Wow. We are so close. Yep. It's going to be a base day. Going to be a base day. Not going to do a lot, to be honest with you. We're so close. What's the point? What is the point? I don't mind a bit of rain, though, to be honest with you. Just checking our uh, our lawn here. Seems uh, it's okay. Uh, nice and tidy. There's some trees growing here if you ever needed wood. Look at the neighbours lawn. It's an absolute mess. they got dead bodies in it. Well, actually, we got a dead body. <laughs> All right, it's 11 o'clock. We are very tired. We'll probably hold off till 12. But tomorrow is day 100, baby. All right, day 100. Now, as always, I do need to survive this day. So I have would have survived 100 days. So we always go to 101. Um, but yeah, we were, we're pretty much there. We're going to check the perimeter out, I think, today. Again, nothing too strenuous, nothing too crazy. What the hell's the point? We've done it on the home stretch. Andy Mann, you absolute legend, you hero. Absolute boss we got a zombie down here we don't even care we got a suppressor now see you later you sucker oh we got a bloody zombie trying to get in here where are you bastard ah there you are get out of it all right but it's 12 o'clock on day 100 we're gonna go to bed when we wake up we'll have survived 100 days we'll see you in the morning all right there we are day 101 we have survived three months 10 days a project zombie months is 30 days so that's 90 and then 10 that's 100. We have survived the 100 days. Let's have a little recap of everything, I think. It's been very good. I've enjoyed this one. I really like this map, St. Paolo's Hammer. It's really, really good. Definitely check it out. That ammo and guns, uh, industrial bit down there, really, uh, really was a game changer for us. I kind of pretty much done everything I wanted to do. These buildings, I mean, we could have probably pushed onto the high street a little bit more maybe, but... You know, there's nothing that we really needed. We was looking for some suppressed weapons, which we found. Um, the M, well, what is it? What is it actually called? The uh, the Car 15 Delta, but we didn't have any 556 or very little. Um, but that was nice. Oh, I tell you what, we are going to do. We're going to drink all this bourbon <laughs> as a celebration. You deserve it, Andy Man. You absolute legend. Um, 8,292 kills. We'll have a quick look at his stats while he's sipping on the bourbon. Uh, reloading, aiming at 5, that's quite nice. Tailoring, we could have done more for tailoring. Mechanics, still at level 4. We didn't need it, though. We are inebriated, so that, that's good Good to know. Um, now, electrics, yeah, I need to worry about farming. Probably would have done we, if we'd have planted more crops, but we have, it hasn't rained. So, uh, carpentry, yeah, pretty good on that, I think. All you need, you know, level 8 is all you need. Probably 7, is it, to build stairs, actually? Um, let's have a look. Rain collect. That's eight, isn't it? Oh, no, that's seven for that as well. So, yeah, I mean, we, yeah, we dinged level eight, didn't we? We wasn't even trying, I remember now. Maintenance, not bad. It's not bad. Short Blunt was a real powerhouse early on. Really was. But, as always, Long Blade took over once we found some machetes. But I definitely, you know, recommend going Short Blunt. Construction worker is a really good um, profession, actually. Um, there are the stat, uh, my traits there, if you want to take the same build. It's a pretty, pretty good build, I would say. Um, 
Sprint and all that, we don't worry about that. Strength and that, 100 days, we got, what, 6,904 fitness. <laughs> oh, well. Um, right, let's have a quick look at our kills. So, bare hands, 12. Long blunt, 50. Short blunt, nearly 2,000. I bet the baton was uh, was the one, wasn't it? Nightstick, yeah, yeah, okay. Long blade, got to be the machete. Cookery, yeah, okay. Firearms, yeah, MP5SD. We only killed 26 with a suppressed one. Um, 753 with the normal MP5. The real, the real winner has got to be the M14, as it? Yeah, nearly 2,000. Uh, one with a spear. <laughs> um, yeah, there we go. There we go. We are probably running out of water here. Uh, why well, have I got empty bottles on me? Oh, yeah, the bourbon. <laughs> um, we got cabbage. Cabbage for days. How many do we actually have here? Can we see? 68. <laughs> okay, there you go. We've got plenty of cabbage. We are ready to re prop, uh, replant some out here when it rains, but we haven't had rain in a few days. But we're very self-sustaining. We could, we've got the water here as well if we need to. It probably will rain. But then winter's coming, so it's probably going to be snowing in a month or so. The car, what a... Oh, look at this guy. Let's have another couple of goes with the, uh, the suppressed MP5 before we call it. Hey, buddy. Um, the car was pretty much fully upgraded how I want it. You can put some other bits on it, but the hood and the trunk were the main ones with the bull bar, which is good. Oh, yeah, metal working. We got to, what, level... Yeah, level six. Nice, nice, nice. Let's deal with these absolute jokers. But, yeah, it's been very... Oh, no. What the hell? They broke one of my crates, you bastards. Ah. Oh, well. Oh, well. But, um, yeah, as I was saying... We've done it. We've done it. And we're tired at 20 past 11. Okay. We may go back to Andy Man. He's been an absolute legend. You've all been legends for watching. Really appreciate it. Thank you. And I will see you uh, in the next series. Cheers.